Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to make this simple origami mouse. This will be the quick tutorial because I know you guys like faster videos and don't want to wait a whole lot. I understand. What we're going to do is I'm going to start off with a square sheet of paper. I did start off with a A4 printer paper and I just cut it into a square. So, first thing we need to do is fold it corner to corner. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Most important are to have these outside corners right. So if they come out right, you know you're in good shape. And what you're going to do is we're going to fold this in half. Because what we want is we want to get a good reference line so that we have something to work with here. We're going to take this tip and we're going to fold it down to this center here. But we're going to leave a little bit of space because when we fold it in half, we don't need the paper bunching up. We're going to do the same thing on both sides. As you can see, I got a little bit of gap in there. That's all you need, just a little bit, because eventually we're going to be folding this and the paper bunches up. Now that we have this, what we're going to do is we're going to take these flaps and we're going to fold them up. right right there we're going to line this up with itself so this edge will stay on this edge of the folded piece not that center crease is our reference line now what we're going to do on the bottom here you have two pieces of paper we're going to take this upper flap we're going to take this point we're going to fold it along the center right about half not critical it can be a little more a little less then we're going to pick it up and we're going to fold the whole thing all the way up and we're going to crease that down now what we're going to do is we're going to fold the paper in half lining up our corners here we're going to try and fold it so that it's a good straight line that's better and we're going to unfold it we're going to leave the folded side down this should be a solid sheet here now what we're going to do is we're going to take this point, fold it up here about halfway, right down to the crease. So I'm going to put my thumb down there, we'll lift this, fold that right about halfway, and then crease that down. Not super critical. If it's not quite halfway, that's okay. We're going to do the same thing on both sides. We're going to do them about the same. So, then we are going to fold this in half. All right, now what we're going to do is open side down. We're going to take this, this is going to be the tail, and we're going to fold it along itself all the way up to this corner. So we're going to fold it there, give that a little crimp. We're going to give it a good crease because we're going to do some reverse folding there. Then we're going to fold it back like so giving it a good crease and we're going to open this up then we're going to push this down the mountain folds are going to make it easy on this side the valley folds we need to reverse so go ahead and reverse that crimp that down and then the next fold we just made down there reverse that and we will crimp that now what we're going to do is we're going to work on the ears so up here we have two flaps one on each side we're going to take this flap, we're going to fold it along the top. Give that a nice crease. Then we're going to take this edge here, and we're going to fold it along this edge. We will crease that down. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Flip that over, line that up against the top, crease that down. Take this edge. Fold it along the side there. And the last thing we can do, you could stop at this point or we can pinch this down and we could spread out the ears. Sometimes it helps to use a pen or pencil. You can just pop those like that. And that's it. There you have it. The origami mouse. 
Okay, I have a challenge for you guys. Here is the bonus round. Do you remember that little piece of paper that you cut off the larger sheet so that you can make your square? What I want you to do is I want you to do the same thing. Make a little square here, and what you're going to do is make Minnie Mouse. This one's a challenge in itself because it is small, and the folds are a little bit more difficult, but you can do it. As you can see, I've done it here. You go ahead and do it. Let me know how it goes for you. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time.